What are you doing here? I just miss you. That's all. Six whole months and not a word from you. I sent you that email. Angela, how could you? This was a bad idea. You think? If she wants to meet a God-fearing man like Elder Durant, she is going to have to cancel that little sex show of hers. Don't listen to him, Mommy. And you know what kind of sex show? Well, your baby sister is making coins, so I don't know what the problem is. Mm -hmm. Do you? Don't bring my wife into this. I remove your hand, please. How long are you willing to wait before you get that good good from the one that you love? One night. If she ain't cracking us that same night, she gotta go. Oh For God. real, brother? Well, yeah. must we always have to continue the cycle of the man? All bets are off. Absolutely, all bets are off. And you see, this is why the poon poon is on lock, shut and, down, because right. since when did sex become a prerequisite to dating? But see, that's the thing. They don't even do that anymore, because all they do is smash mm. with no commitment. Mm. Mm. That's not true. There are a lot of men that want an emotional connection like you do. Wake up and smell the flowers. Do you know what world we live in? A world where everyone is in a situation. Take this one, for example. Put that in mind. Doesn't it make sense that maybe you should wait until it's all clear? I think no. we should. I think we should wait. No, we shouldn't because men like sex. Okay, you cannot be this thick. Baby, I can be thicker. Oh! Please stop encouraging this guy. Don't do that. I love so much. What is happening? No, 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 I can't take this, no. What's happening? Woo, wait a minute. Okay, so Leslie, what happened to waiting? Girl, I'm not trying to marry this dude. I ain't trying to marry you. Okay, 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 okay. All right, so maybe we can get, you know, just sign up for this junk away. Please. She can stop, you know, riding the pony, and we can get back on track. Marcus? How long were you willing to wait before, you know, you get the skins? Well, this celibacy thing is, <laughs> it's hard. I've been uh, celibate for about two months now, and um, I think that if you find that special someone, that you should wait. You mm. should wait. Okay. Are you seriously gonna listen to this dude? Yeah, no man wants to wait, and if he ain't getting it from his girl, he gonna go find it from somebody wow. else. That's real. Are you really that ignorant? Look, look, look. I'm not in denial about the way men operate. Uh, take Josiah, for example. The brother is fine. Mm. And though I would love to drop it like it's hot for only one night, I'm waiting. Oh, she waiting. <laughs> you waiting for what exactly? What, what, a man that respects you in the morning? Because I promise I will. Ooh. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 OMG. OK, wait, what oh, is wow. happening? Oh, my God. Oh, All right. So um, I'm going to let them have their fun. We're over now, but I would love to hear from you. Leave me some love in the comments and on the social media let me know how you feel. Oh, how long are you oh. willing to wait before you get that good good? All right, so it is over. And oh, okay. See, why does my baby sister have to have a goddamn sex show? Tisk, tisk, tisk. I thought I told you no more TV. Woman, what in the world are you wearing? Surprise. <sighs> now listen here, Megan. What the hell are you doing? Ah, thought it'd be fun. Add a little spice to things. Oh, come on, baby. It's late. And I'm not in the mood for one of your little games. Another time, okay, sweetie? Oh, oh, woman, have you lost your goddamn mind? Oh, baby, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hit you so hard. <sighs> Look at here. Mm -hmm. I know Big Papa is about to sop you up uh -huh. like a buttermilk biscuit. Uh -huh. But don't you ever, ever uh -huh. pull some mess like that, you hear? Mm -hmm. Because next time, you may not get this response. Mm -hmm. Which, in all honesty, 
has me feeling very confused. Uh, Understand? Yes, baby. Okay. Good. Oh! That's a wrap, y'all. That's a wrap. Come on, that's a wrap. The show's wrap. over. Y'all, that's a wrap. <laughs> Go ahead. Oh, yes. All right. Okay. Yeah. Um, so look, okay. tonight's show was off the chain. Yes. <laughs> Okay, so did you get a look at the social media numbers, though? Elisa's working on a report, and we'll send you an email later tonight. But I took a look during the tape, and uh, it looked good, yee, 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 yee. Yes, but okay. well, let's not get too excited. Okay, all right, because you know we have that big meeting coming up with a potential advertiser. I know. And we got to make sure that all, all of our, our ducks are in a row. row. I know. Okay, I'm sorry, but you know I get a little cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. But this deal could be a game changer. I know. <laughs> oh, where are you going? You're not heading out, are you? I'm, I'm just going to make a phone call real quick. Oh, OK. I ain't going nowhere. All right. Thanks so much for being a part of this. You're ridiculous. Mm. Yeah, man, I'm just doing what y'all do. Oh, it was good, brother. Yo, Kyle, where you at, man? I'm at home. Why, what's up? You should really come to the spot I'm at. They got some nice people. I don't know, man. It's kind of late, but you're there. Maybe you can make the connect. Nah, man. Um, I think you should do this on your own. Don't play me. Who do you piss off now? Look, you know my flavor ain't for everybody, but seriously, man, you gonna come through or not? All right, man. Just uh, just text me where you at. All right, cool, cool. Bet. Taking me for granted Never knowing that you had it And never knowing what you had Now you wanna come around, baby And you wanna tell me all of them things That you know I'd like to hear You know I'd like to hear You should've said it when you had me You should've showed it when you had me Doing out of bed. Did you have a bad dream? Yeah. I had a bad dream. I know you're not about to get on the phone during our movie night. You watched it the whole entire time. What are you talking about? Hey, so I actually have to um I have to go. What's going on? Mom ran away from home again. I can't do this right now, Angela. <laughs> Angela, what? I can't believe you came. Of course I can. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Tamala Baldwin, and we just finished watching another episode of Bubbly Brown Sugar. So in this episode, we see why Gregory, Jules' brother, was so, I guess, disgusted. <laughs> disgusted by what Jewel is putting out there on the internet. Um, she really is spending her nights talking about sex and relationships, which I think is really cool. You know, I don't know why Gregory is such a hater, but I think it's because there's something going on within their family and it's pretty serious. So, and Greg is kind of taking the brunt of it Whereas Jewel, she sees what's happening, but she still gets to play and have her fun and, you know, have girls straddle her guests, you know, while they're just talking and creating content and making the world laugh. And on top of that, in this episode, you were able to see how, once again, the universe is trying to bring Jewel and Caleb together in the same space when Josiah calls his boy and was like, yo, you need to roll through, son. You know, you should come through and meet these people. He, he, he prefaces it by saying it's for business and for sale. And, jo and Josiah definitely cares about that. But I wonder if he was thinking like, hmm, 
Jewel would be a good fit for Caleb because he kind of looks back at her before he makes the call. You know, it's like, like he's kind of playing matchmaker, I think. What do you think? Let me know. And so Caleb is like, yeah, I'll go through so we can get this money. So we'll see what happens in episode six. Like maybe Jewel and Caleb are about to meet and it's gonna be happily ever after. <laughs> so make sure you check back um, for episode six. Stay tuned, we'll see. Woo! Bye.